Paul Bennett and I'm here in Millbridge, Maine at Down East Under Creations. And uh, what I wanted to talk about today is uh, the Inventables X-Carve 2018 model. Uh, it doesn't matter whether it's the 1000 millimeter, the 750 or the 500 millimeter. Um, when you go to calibrate the machine, part of the calibration is adjusting the V wheels that go that run on the maker slides to make sure that they um, are together and there's no slop, so that things move uh, easily. They have an eccentric, a little eccentric cam, a little nut that you turn, and uh, and that's all well and fine. It works well with the tools they give you, but there's one in particular that is a little bit of a problem, and that is on the Z axis. Uh, the uh, the V wheels that run up and down for the uh, that move the spindle up and down. Um, you can get three of the four of the adjustable V wheels with the three millimeter hex key that comes with the kit. But there's one in particular. If you're facing the machine, it's the lower uh, right hand side um, V wheel. There's not enough room behind it to get the hex key in. So a very simple solution is uh, if you have a spare 3 millimeter hex key, which I happen to have one in my toolbox, I just simply cut it down shorter so I had room to get in behind there. So a uh, very quick little video clip to show you what I did, how I just cut it shorter, and how it fits. That's all there is to it. It's a very easy solution. No fuss, no muss, no problems. So. Please remember to subscribe to my channel, and I hope this is a good solution for those of you that uh, have bought an X-Carve and you're setting it up. Thanks for watching. Nope, doesn't work. This is the hex key that, 3 millimeter hex key that came with uh, the Inventables uh, X-Carve kit. And this little roller here uh, on the Z-axis is the last one that uh, I'm working on, but I can't, I have it adjusted, but I can't tighten it up because that doesn't fit. Solution. I took this little uh, a spare hex key, 3 millimeter hex key I had in my toolbox, cut it down, let's see what happens now. Alrighty, so now I can go ahead and I can tighten up, I can go get my wrench and I can tighten that wheel up uh, just as snug as all the others so that it's all uniform. And you can see it's right in there, no problem.